Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Marco and today I will be reacting to One Piece episodes 98 and 99. I am very excited. We are continuing this journey across the desert. We are in Alabasta Kingdom and last two episodes were pretty fun. We saw that town who was known as Town of Green being all destroyed and buried beneath the sand. We also learned that that Dense powder is probably uh, someone framing the king because in the capital it's uh, very often raining and people are starting to blame king that he is using dense powder. That's probably part of the plan from Crocodile and Baroque works. This is really really deep so it's not going to be easy to uh, show people that we mean good and th that crocodile is bad because crocodile is presenting himself in a very uh, bright light so vivi wants to go to the leader of rebel army to talk to him and we are going to the desert and we are dealing with sandstorms we are fighting giant creatures we are dealing with the birds who are stealing stuff and <laughs> there is all sorts of uh, troubling uh, things happening but we are handling everything fine and Ace is with us as well <laughs> so no need to worry. We are continuing our way to Juba and we saw uh, at, the, at the ending of the last episode they showed the scene of some big guy and I think it, there was a girl as well. Uh, it was someone's ship so I don't know if that ship is in desert or it's someone approaching the coast of alabasta so very excited for next episode guys without further ado let's jump into episode number 98 all right guys that was episodes 98 and 99 i enjoyed these episodes it seems like we are basically going on these little adventures throughout Alabasta and we met those sand pirates who at first I thought are going to be our enemies but actually no they were pretty chill and we met that girl uh, Rose right or Rosa or something uh, she was in that town present and she was giving Vivi flowers and the king swore to protect their city and if there is a trouble that he will be there and that unfortunately did not happen and it's probably because of crocodile that all these people are suffering right now so that was really sad to see but at the end when she waved to vivi that was pretty sweet Ace was on a little side quest on its own, <laughs> killing scorpions, making friends with lizards. Luffy and Vivi were riding those sand slates. It was it was pretty fun. And in this episode, we had these like four thugs basically lying to people that they are rebel soldiers, just that so that they can eat well and have a place to stay. That was pretty embarrassing and cowardly and. I'm glad that it got resolved the way it did. It showed that they really care deep inside and that these kids remind them of them as kids as well. They were looking up to those soldiers. So that's pretty cool. I like the idea that Vivi had to test them and to see what's in their hearts. So now the people will actually allow them to stay and they saw them as heroes right now and kids will look up to them so that was pretty dope we are still not in yuba i hope that we will get there soon uh, we got teased now uh, vivi saw the figure the silhouette of kid saying uh, goodbye to vivi and that she will become a great princess so that's probably yet another person from her childhood and you can tell that Vivi love her country and her people, man. I can totally see that. So, yeah, I guess that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching as always, guys. If you like my reactions, consider subscribing, leave a like, comment, all that good stuff as always. Check out my Patreon page. The link is in description. If you want to see this early, I will be seeing you very soon with another video. Until then, take care and have a nice day. See ya.